Good afternoon. Welcome to another episode of Oswin By My Side. Today it is a Friday during Lent and uh, I'm going to make the simplest and in my opinion one of the best tasting walleye. Um, it might be fish and chips because I'm not from Britain. I'm not sure exactly all what all that qualifies but it's fish and french fries and uh, if you've never tried it this way you'll blow your mind. Most people when they think of walleye done in butter in a pan, they're thinking lemon pepper or maybe some Cajun seasoning. I pull out a whole bunch of seasonings because I've tried a ton. I got the red lobster seasoning for seafood. That's actually not bad. I've got the Cajun style. And whenever you want that little bit of spice here, I've got just some plain old garlic powder. But the number one Seasoning. I actually look for lemon pepper because I've done a lot of fish, uh, walleye and lemon pepper. I don't even have it in my house anymore because when I want to go to just a good flavored walleye cooked in butter, it's stupid, simple, and easy and I can have a, a meal in 10 minutes, I go with Montreal chicken seasoning. That's right. I got the big thing because that's how much I enjoy it. I got Montreal chicken seasoning just for my walleye. But first, we need to get those french fries going. So very simple. French fry or potato uh, smasher thingamajiggy. I think I'm missing some pieces. Oh, I am. The back piece. Right there. This is how little I make french fries. And, yep. But it's Lent, the best time of the year, personally, leading up to the very best holiday of the year. And uh, I mean, I know some people like, uh, now the diet I'm on, the carb is supposed to be as big as your fist. So that's probably as big as my fist. I know this is for sure as big as my fist. So, well, no, it's not even too big to even get in there. Knife. This thing chopped down to size. French fries. Second batch, and I will do the ends too. Well, that would be a more of an American potato. Put this away. Got my french fries cut up here. I'm going to throw those into the deep fryer. There's already, you can see I've already got it plugged in. It's been heating now for a little bit. Throw those in and let them start frying. I don't like that. Well, that's ridiculous. We'll go like that. Set the timer. Ten minutes. fish. You can see I've already got the flame going underneath my pan. So I'm just going to drop the butter. Get that melting. While that is starting to melt, grab my walleye. Montreal chicken seasoning. Better than lemon pepper. It's got plenty of lemon pepper in it. Ingredients, garlic, salt, onions, spices include black pepper, parsley, red pepper, 
orange peel, paprika, green bell peppers, and sufficient agents. So maybe it doesn't have lemon pepper. All I know is it's amazing. And it tastes good in my mouth. And these walleyes are not that thick. They say it's about a minute and a half to two minutes per inch. That is about an inch to an inch and a half. So when I throw this in the butter, I'm going to go two minutes on one side, flip it, one or two minutes. I've got eight minutes left on my timer just for my potatoes. Oh shit. Well, that wasn't very smart. Now I'm going to have a house full of plastic. I thought that thing was designed for that. Mix these up a little bit. Mm. First time I've ever used this thing. Can you tell? My sister got it for me for a uh, Christmas present almost two years ago because I said I wanted a deep fryer so I could fry french fries and try little fish things. I have never used it. And finally, I'm finally on a uh, on a diet that allows me to uh, enjoy potatoes again. And I love this diet. I'm down 30 pounds. All right, we've got seven minutes until the the French fries are done. Um, it's going to take about five minutes to do these, so I'm going to throw the fish in there. It's going to start to fry. Wash my station up. I like a clean kitchen. Clean kitchen too? No? Yeah, such a good boy. Are you my cook? Are you my are you my sous chef? Stupidest, simplest recipe in the world. I'll probably be cutting a lot of this out. Maybe I'll get on the dishes right now. Um, we've got uh, we've gone one minute on that fish. I'm gonna start these dishes. And by the time these french fries are done, the fish will be done. Probably about a minute or other, earlier than that. Ooh, a little long. Not to worry about that. It's already flaking. Flays are already flaking off. So I am another minute and they're going to be done. <laughs> you know your wall is done when it's breaking apart. Just some butter, butter fried walleye. Potatoes, they say a minute thirty left. They're done. So, with that in mind, my buttery walleye right here, my protein. Salt. You gotta have salt. I wish I had some vinegar, right? I think I could go Canadian style on this suckers. I'm gonna give it about 30 
30 seconds to cool. Get a fork. Very excited though. Homemade french fry. Very hot. Use more salt. Alright, it's been 10 minutes. Montreal chicken seasoning, walleye fried in butter. Meal is done in 10 minutes. That's some good walleye. I'm gonna eat this and take a nap. Mm.